now lava from a volcano in southwestern Iceland has reached the nearby fishing port of Grindavik, setting several homes on fire. Some of the defences built there after an eruption last month have also been breached. Most of the town's 4,000 people had already been evacuated. Nick Peak has the latest. In the line of fire, the Icelandic town of Grindavik homes consumed by the creeping lava from this latest eruption. The fishing community had been evacuated hours before, but newly built defences weren't enough to stop the flow. People of Iceland, what we all hoped would not happen has come to pass. Lava is flowing into Grindavik, a thriving town where people have built their lives, engaged in fishing and other occupations and created a community in harmony with God and one another. Overnight, pockets of molten rock kept on bursting through and bubbling up, although the activity seemed to be stabilising. But this is the second eruption in just a month. For John, who with his neighbours have been forced from their homes, there's huge uncertainty about whether they'll be able to go back. I'm born in this town. I actually live in the house that I'm born in. And it's kind of, it's, it's a tough, it's a tough thought to think that, that this town might be over. It's extremely sad. It's just uh, unbelievable. You know, I th thought that I would never live to, you know, witness this. It's been quiet for 800 years. 800 years. Experts believe the spectacular explosions last month may have heralded a new era on this, the Reykjanes Peninsula. Nothing like this had been seen here for the past 800 years. So regular eruptions could be on the way. A nation that's been built around the twin perils of ice and fire, now facing more danger and more uncertainty. Nick Beek. BBC News.